You're watching Nightmare on Lakeshire. Enjoy. <laughs> Hey everybody, so uh, it's been a while, but I uh, want to give you kind of a, uh, a quick, uh, maybe like a daytime walkthrough. Um, Steve is coming over um, tomorrow, and we're going to finish uh, cleaning up the wires, um, the little tiny uh, details um, and that, but uh, I've been kind of busy on getting a lot of the detailing done, because uh, Steve hasn't had a lot of time to do that, and I've kind of been doing it uh, when I can, so... Uh, I've been wanting to get a lot of it done, so uh, here's kind of the daytime walkthrough. Um, I'll give you an, maybe an official one, uh, obviously later on next week. So uh, with actors, I mean uh, a nighttime with actors and all that jazz. So uh, anyway, so here's the uh, daytime. The door, you guys have seen most of this crap, um, but this table obviously is not staying like this. We gotta get it all cleaned up. There's a shelf. There's a lot of that kind of junk. This, uh, I'm going to have Steve because it actually works and knocks really loud. So I'm going to have Steve take that and shake it uh, behind people. So, and he can actually beat on the wood and stuff. So, so that's going to be that. Got this, like all the wires that are hanging and all that. We got to fix all of that stuff still. But, um, but anyways, there's the cracker. This wall's got to get finished. Uh, this, I don't, I've got all the curtains pulled up so we can get through. Uh, but here's the curtain area. We still got to put uh, one more strobe in here, but we've got two. But wall of purses and messed up looking Barbies. And all these uh, curtains will be uh, down in their face as they're walking through. And I got one strobe there, one strobe there, and we're going to have one up there. So this is going to be pretty freaking chaotic. Put this up, and then here is my room, still as you can see, kind of also a dump hole right now, um, but uh, you still get the idea. This is uh, gore, that, that we got a bag of gore from Gore Galore this year, and uh, it actually looks pretty cool uh, in, the, uh, in the shed here. So this is what I've just kind of been working on today. Yeah, this is all this bag of gore um, stuff that it... It looks pretty, pretty cool. I hung that guy. We got an extra one of them. Hung him upside down, spray painted him, and then that's great stuff there, there, and the piece of gore from Gore Galore. So, this I think I'm the proudest of uh, so far. So, so far, I mean, I've just kind of been working on about a half hour or so, uh, but I think it looks pretty, pretty cool. This is my rat. Got him from Johnny Brock's a couple years ago. It looks like he's uh, getting flesh fed to him, which is pretty funny. Um, but uh, yeah, those are the meat hooks that I made, which actually they, they turned out pretty cool. Did not buy that one, <laughs> but I you know I bought that one. Did not make that one. Uh, but as you can see, that that gore from uh, Gore Galore, all it is, um, it's just uh, here. Let me show you. It's just um, I think like extra strips of you know latex from whatever they're making. And instead of throwing it away, they're making money off of it. So we got it at Transworld for I think it was like uh, a, a whole bag for like twenty bucks, maybe thirteen. Um, I don't know why, but thirteen sticking in my head. Um, and uh, we actually got two of those. So I got one more bag downstairs uh, that uh, that we got to use as well. So this is pretty pretty messed up. So then I got this guy, and the cool thing is, is that the way the lights and everything are going to be in here, uh, you do not see Farmer Fred until it's too late. Um, so I kind of like that. He's going to be a scare in himself and there's nothing to it. So, and then we got our wall up here. Got the beam. Uh, we got to get one more beam from there going across because uh, the door is real wobbly. But uh, got the fencing up. So that is, that's that. So I'm not real happy with the look from the uh, front view like this. Uh, if Steve and I have time, I may... Uh, figure something else out for that but um, for now that's what it looks like so anyways a uh, quick video and uh, that's it hey uh, let me do a kind of a quick announcement here um, if you're on my Facebook uh, you may already know this uh, but a lot of my Halloween stuff is going to be 
um, up for sale. The thing is, I'm not going to ship it. So if you you got to kind of live in the area or be driving through to pick some stuff up. Uh, but uh, but yeah, this year uh, kind of going all out like this, and it's going to be kind of my last year for a while. Um, I want to kind of take uh, maybe a year or two off doing this um, and just really focus in on my family and uh, kind of where. Uh, where we're going in life and all that. So, um, so anyways, um, so that's that. So I just thought I'd let you guys know. Um, so if you guys know anybody in my area, like the St. Louis um, area that's needing some Halloween stuff, um, let them know because uh, a lot of this is going to be going up for sale. So not all of it, but a lot of it is. Um, so anyways, so that's it. That's a kind of a walkthrough daytime. I'm not completely finished yet, uh, but uh, you kind of get the, the gist of it. So anyways, uh, leave a comment below, subscribe, like, and um, hope you guys are getting busy. We're, we're exactly uh, over a week, I mean, six days now. So uh, get to work. So anyways, talk to you guys later. Peace out.